Hello again. Today I'm going to show you how to complete the Canon rebate. Now I bought a Canon 5D Mark III with this PIXMA 100, it's a PIXMA Pro 100, and it also came with this photo paper plus semi-gloss. Um, at first I thought that I would have to send in UPC symbols for all of these, but that's not the case. I'm going to still show you where those UPC symbols are though. This is for the Canon Mark III. Um, this is also the serial number. Luckily you get to keep that. Here it is for the paper. Sorry, that side. This thing right here, sorry. And then most importantly, because the rebate is actually on the printer, I have to take the UPC symbol off of the box. And it's this part right here which you won't be able to see clearly because I'm not going to get closer, but when you look on your own box, it's clearly labeled UPC, or Proof of Purchase. Now the important thing to know is that Canon does not want just the paper, just the label outside. You have to cut off the box with it. It's their way of verifying that you've actually purchased a product and not just made a copy of some number. So I cut this out before. I'm going to just loosen it a little bit now and and pull it out and I actually had to spend a lot of time cutting it because the, the um, cardboard is surprisingly thick so make sure that you you know get all of it because um, that's what they want to see and I would suggest cutting a larger size than this because this is really small and as you see it you know it was starting to peel off and just give yourself room for error but anyway, you leave the hole in the box, and when you're cutting into the box, you don't need to worry about hitting anything because it's it's just dead space here. And then beyond that, there is styrofoam. Um, but this is a good half inch thick, I would say, of of um, cardboard, maybe more. Anyway. It's thick, so just expect that, and it's you know got different sections, so you're going to have to cut through a lot. But anyway, once you cut that out, you need to send it in with this form, which you will get online, and you'll need to write in the serial number of the product that you're getting the rebate for. So this, in this case, for the Pixma Pro 100, I have to write in that serial number. I send it in with this proof of purchase, and I also need to send in the receipts of, um, you know, the receipts for the stuff that I bought. And they want a legible copy, so you can keep your reg your original receipt, but they do want that legible copy. Um, on the back of this, you'll fill out your name and your mailing address with your daytime phone number and your email address. Um, they want to make sure that you make copies of everything so that you have, you know, records of it. And I believe that's it. They also give you the address where you send it to, but just to recheck or just to go over it again, the claim checklist is that you have this completed claim form, you have written the serial number of the product that you're claiming for, and they give you a nice space for that. You also need to have a legible copy of your sales receipts from the authorized Canon dealers. If you're not buying it from an authorized Canon dealer, you probably won't get the rebate, but you might as well try. You also need the original proof of purchase, which is going to be a, this with the 12-digit barcode on it. And you should make copies, and then you mail it to the Canon address that's on the back of this form. In this case, I'm sending it to the mail-in rebate promotion offices in Memphis, Tennessee. And I will list all of that information in the video below. So now you've seen what you need to do, go get your Canon rebate. 